Stephen, did the, um, the CQC report on Bowser the Dark Muscle come as a total surprise to you? It did, I have to say. I mean, like everyone else, I was uh, shocked and appalled at the uh, information that came out earlier this week. Uh, like many others, I had always thought that uh, Basildon Thurrock University Hospital Trust was a, a, a great place serving the community really well. That's what the inspections had told us previously and so when this new report came out and it demonstrated that there were some serious failings, uh, I, like many other people, am very concerned. Do you think heads should roll? Um, I think that's the easy option. I think we need to actually look at what the problems are. Uh, I think we need to look at the monitor monitoring uh, regime that's in place. How has that failed us? How can a hospital that was described as good only a few months ago be now top of the worst hospitals in the country? Uh, so maybe hedge to roll, but that's the easy option. I think we need to get to the root of the, the problem and maybe that's looking at are we too target driven? Are we ticking boxes and actually not putting patient care and hygiene at the top of the agenda? Uh, so let's have a, a proper review of what the problems are and then decide whether or not there are consequences for individuals. I mean, some critics have said they want to see non-executive directors, they want to see chief executives walking the wards and, and actually being in there, not just being in comfortable boardrooms. Would that apply to a possible future MP? Uh, absolutely, yes. I mean, I over the last three years try to get as involved in the local community as I can. Obviously at the moment as a candidate that's difficult but certainly as uh, if I'm fortunate enough to be the Member of Parliament I would want to take an active interest in these things on behalf of my constituents. I want to be their champion to make sure that they are getting the service that they deserve. Yeah.